Well, good evening. I'm Dennis Owen. So, Alicia's off tonight. I'm Valerie Pritchett. Board members in the school district of Lancaster are set for a vote tonight, but not about masks for students. It's about testing and vaccines for teachers and employees. Brian Munoz live in Lancaster to explain what makes this plan unique. Hi, Brian. Yeah, good evening. Today's vote is driven by board members. They believe that this is the opportunity to make change, um, and tonight that vote will happen. When I talk to board members from other districts, we say this, all say the same thing. This is, it's not what we signed up for. All across the country, school board meetings have become emotional battlegrounds. From shouting matches to protests, board members have seen it all. Lancaster County school boards have faced tough decisions in recent weeks. There's so many things out there with COVID and, and it's changing so quickly. And, and you know, school districts are big beasts that don't change quickly. And while President Biden's vaccine mandate technically doesn't apply to public institutions, the school district of Lancaster is trying to stick to the spirit of that mandate. We know that mandates are not really palatable at this time in history, and, and we're, we're trying not to go down that road, but you know, our priority is to keep our classrooms safe. But the school district of Lancaster says this latest vote is not about a vaccine mandate. Technically, it's a testing mandate, and the way to avoid testing is to get vaccinated. I believe that everyone thinks it is the right course. Of course, you know, we have had two weeks to discuss things with our constituencies and to read through it more carefully and think about it. So, you know, my colleagues may show up with more questions. And the latest numbers from the teachers union show that between 85 to 90 percent of school staff members in Pennsylvania are already vaccinated. What we found from our members is that they're they're willing to take whatever steps need to be taken to keep uh, that community safe so that we don't have situations where students have to quarantine or teachers have to quarantine or we have to see school buildings close temporarily. The board is expected to vote on the testing mandate tonight and if it passes it'll likely uh, explain and discuss where the testing would happen and who would conduct it. Live in Lancaster, Brian Munoz, ABC 27 News.